how is it, how do I use them together is they, it's phenomenal at um, a giving me uh, more tools to help patients understand what they've got to do to keep these derangements reduced. And then B, it gives me lots of more functional uh, positions uh, to, to start helping with patients that are a little bit slower to respond and or mechanical non-responders to, uh, to um, get them, get them back to where they need to be as far as, you know, uh, whether they're just uh, athletics or just, um, you know, masters type of stuff or just um uh, you know like i, I want to walk i want to play some tennis you know recreational you know type of thing but it just helps you so much to get get those movement patterns back under control and once they just start moving differently and it takes some time the older you are uh, and, and also i probably don't have anywhere near the success lynn has in in uh, new orleans because my population I have a lot of work with comp and the buy-in it's, it's hard to get people to buy into to mdt sometimes because it's you know MDT is not fluff. Uh, it is basically putting the patient to work, teaching them to, to fix themselves type of thing. And so that's kind of what, what GOATA is. And she's dealing with people that are, you know, high school athletes trying to become first string or trying to get a college scholarship or college athletes trying to get the pros and the pros trying to stay in the pros where all the money is. Uh, but when I get somebody that buys in, man, I mean, there's, there's no denying that they get better faster, get better and they're able to maintain things better. Uh, so, so yeah, they work hand in hand.